Hi guys, it's Crafty Girl. Today we're going to be making this cute paper doll shoe. It's pretty durable. I'm pressing down on it and it's staying intact. So first before we do, I'm going to give you some advice. So you can do this on any doll, but I like to do it on the Monster High dolls. You should probably do it on the dolls with a slanted foot. So you see the foot has a size on it. This is right. How lean on her right foot, she wears a size two. And on her left foot, she wears a size one. So don't assume that all dolls will fit into the same shoes and their feet are actually different sizes sometimes. So, first what you're going to do is you're gonna cut out a whole bunch of little squares out of heavy duty construction paper. I picked pink because that is Helen's favorite color. Red Helen? Yes, that is my absolute favorite color. That's why you're wearing a pink dress. Oh, you should tell them how to make that sometime. Oh, well, that's a great idea. So then you want to glue them with a glue stick on top of each other. You want to glue, well, first, sorry. You want to trace the foot and then draw a line where there's a slant in the foot. Then you want, on this is on one piece of paper, then you want to glue them all together and you want to glue five under that. Then you want to cut it out and wait until it dries a little bit before you do that. So then you have this when you're done. Then you want to press it to the foot like this so it shapes it. I'm sorry that you guys can't see that very well. I have to hold the doll really, oh, I have to hold how it will lean a really weird way. Sorry, how lean. Oh, that's okay, don't worry about it, but okay. So then you want to press it to her foot firmly. Does that hurt? No, I'm okay. You want to press it to the foot pretty firmly without actually damaging the doll's foot. Do not use any heat for this because you may damage the doll's foot. Once you have it shaped like this, you are going to let it dry completely. Once it is dry, you are going to roll a paper tube about this wide in diameter cut and glue then you want to cut it into a small portion of the tube so you don't have to cut off a whole bunch and then you want to cut a slant then you want to cut it a slant like this until the heel can touch the ground, like this. Keep making perfections until you, until the shoe is perfect, like. Sometimes, you know, you have to cut a lot, like this. Then you want to cut off the point at the end so it doesn't hurt her foot. Like this. And then you want to put glue all over the heel of the sole and on the heel. Then attach, hold firmly, and let dry overnight so you don't accidentally peel it off. And you want to press pretty firmly onto the shoe. So it's kind of a bit flat, but it's not very flat. So it looks like this. But right about now, you are probably most likely wondering, but how is her foot going to stay on that? Well, it's not. 
that is exactly what I'm going to show you next. So you can, you don't have to, you have to wait overnight until you can put the doll's foot in here. But to do the next step, you don't have to wait overnight. So then you want to cut a strip. Oh, the camera, sorry. So you want to cut it until it's about half a centimeter wide. And five and a half centimeters long, but you can always cut it. And in inches, that is one fourth of an inch wide and two and a half inches long. So be sure to put the cap on your glue after you're done so you don't so your glue doesn't dry out. And for all my younger crafters out there, I want you to ask permission for your parents if using hot materials or anything like that. So then, you want to glue the strip onto the shoe. Then you want to fold it. So you want to, I don't know if you, you guys can see that, but hold on, let me focus it. Oh, that made it worse. There we go. So you want to put it on and bend over the shoe. Then glue on the bent part and stick it on to about here on the shoe about where the foot bend line is and then you want to cut the end and do the same for the other side and don't smoosh the heel while doing this step and don't get frustrated if you don't get it the first time Remember, if at first you don't exceed, try, try again. So, you want to glue that on and let it sit overnight. Then you can put the shoe onto the doll. You will see Halloween wearing these in further videos. So let's sit overnight and then you are done. Bye crafters, happy crafting!